It is my pleasure to welcome His Excellency Mr. Klaus Werner Ioannis, President of Romania. Your Excellency, you have the floor. Thank you, Madam Chair. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, there is no denial that climate change is a tremendous challenge and that we need to show ambition in addressing it. From 1989 to 2019, Romania's greenhouse gas emissions decreased by 64 percent. We have one of the lowest rates of emissions per capita in the European Union. Between 1990 and 2019, Romania has also reduced its CO2 emission intensity per unit of GDP by 77 percent, a percentage more than double the global average. But we are committed to do more Further reducing emissions will be challenging, especially as we move closer to net zero. I want us to work together to develop, manufacture and deploy new green technologies. Innovation is key. Among other Glasgow initiatives, Romania joins the US-driven agriculture innovative mission for climate. We also need to make sure that nobody is left behind in the process of green transition. Jobs are created and social inequalities reduced. Romania fully supports the European Union's leading efforts on climate change and is committed to contribute to the EU overall 55 percent emission reduction by 2030. We have already achieved this reduction rate nationally and we are committed to keep cutting. Ladies and gentlemen, there is no silver bullet against climate change. A set of interconnected measures can help us deliver. We will harness the very force of nature. Romania has a solid share of renewable energy in its energy mix with 40% of our electricity coming from renewable sources. We are committed to expand this share. We will fight climate change with nature-based solutions using 57,000 hectares of new forests in our recovery plan to capture carbon and combat desertification. We also need to channel the force of people in addressing climate change. Education is key to environmentally friendly behavior. We must advance education and research on climate change. Starting in 2023, Romania will host an innovative World Meteorological Organization Center that will help agricultural systems in Europe to better respond to climate change. The impact of climate change has no national borders. Let's join our forces in protecting the environment, making sure we leave future generations a greener and a safer planet. There is no time to lose. The time for action is now. Thank you very much. Thank you, Your Excellency.